Hello everyone. Today I'm going to showcase one of the advanced filters that we had implemented in one of our clients project. So this is the admin page where the admins of the portal can see all the applicants along with a lot of filtering. I'll just give you a quick background of the application. So this is meant for language translation and uh, any language translators across the globe could register on this portal along with any services that they provide and their rates. So here we have a normal view and we also have a detailed view. So when I go to detailed, you can see that it expands with even more detailed view right so we get the language we can also see uh, their costing here right um, early rate is uh, 50 rupees translation is 0 0.4 per word and so on and so forth okay if they have multiple languages added we can see uh, multiple language as well so let me show you that you can see here Bulgarian, Berber and Catalan, Bulgarian. So this is a detailed view and this would be a normal view. Not only that, since this translators could be from anywhere, uh, the admin wanted to know what is the residing country and what is their native country to understand a bit more about the applicant. I could filter out based on the residing country. I could filter based on the native country or the source language, the target language, right? So let's say I search for Hindi, right? So I get all the applicants who give translation service from Hindi. Okay. Now target language is empty. So it could be anything. Likewise. If I give Telugu, right, I'll get all the applicants who have Telugu as their source language. We also have subject of expertise. We have experience levels, right? These two are internal filters. We could uh, filter them based on the status. What stage of application are they in? Um, we could search with their names not only that so the advanced filtering starts here when i click on this you see even more filters being shown now if i check this box it would show me all the translators who provide translation as a service right now i can even go one step further and say okay within translation i want someone who charges between 0 0.3 to 0 0.5 okay you see here z from 0 0.3 we have 10 records if i put 0 0.5 then we have seven records if i put 0 0.4 then we have five records i can also say i need someone who also gives subtitling okay there is no record so let me just remove this one and we have one so we can filter out multiple things here i can say i need proofreading as well so you can see this person has translation proofreading mtp transcription subtitling and all of this in one of the languages of course once i know that this is the person that we are looking for i can click on this one to open a detailed view so this is the advanced filtering that we had done for one of our clients and this was all done using url parameters right so even if i refresh let me refresh the page no once the page is refreshed you can see that it comes back with the same filters that we had applied before so this means 
we can also share the url with our colleagues so that they can get the same filters that we have already applied so overall we have about 35 to 40 filters on this page this shows we can have any number of filters on a bubble page thanks for watching have a nice day